So now when you think back over your past week and a half that you've been driving, <clears throat> if you would have taken something like this more in the beginning, would you have freaked out? Uh, honestly, I think um, so. Yeah. I got hurt on the slopes, dude. <laughs> I don't have any way down to like Denver, man. <laughs> the Virginia guy. <laughs> yeah. There you go. That was, that's your famous one. Good morning, American Red. How are we all doing this morning? I just wanted to shout out a big thanks to all our brand new subscribers. Welcome to our channel. And we hope you enjoy all of our content. We try to make it enjoyable as possible and you know, try to make it as real as possible, because it is real. <laughs> uh, you know, just trying to make it feel like you're in the driver's seat driving basically and you're just on the ride with us so yeah we really appreciate you guys uh, subscribing and being with us so today we are in Denver Colorado well a little bit outside Colorado Denver Colorado uh, we're in Loveland Colorado and we are headed to Cheyenne Wyoming this morning to go pick up a load at a Lowe's over there that we have been to on these videos many 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 times so we're gonna go pick up that load and then we are going to head to Prescott, Arizona where my previous student, Daniel, not the one I kicked off, but Daniel, the amazing driver, uh, we're gonna go over to Prescott, Arizona where he got sick off of a KFC bowl. <laughs> oh man, I felt so bad for that guy. That was, that was really unfortunate that he got food poisoning. We didn't know it was food poisoning at the time, but we, that's, that's what I deduced it down to. It was food poisoning for sure. It took him a couple days to get over. So he was just sicker than a dog. He was sitting up in his bed, sleeping, sitting up. I don't even know how somebody does that, but I guess if you're tired enough, you could probably do that. So we're headed over to Prescott, Arizona. It is about, so from right here to Prescott, Arizona, it's almost a thousand miles. So pretty good. Pretty good loads we've been having lately. Uh, so from Tuesday this last week to Tuesday today, we did uh, 4,997 miles. Overall, not bad with a student. So that's really, really good. So Adrian's driving really well. Uh, we got some backing that we need to work on and as far as everything else he's doing very very well on everything else so it's pretty impressive uh, but I'll take you guys along through the uh, canyons where Transformers I, I want to say it was like Transformers 3 or 4 I was one of those anyways right along that road that's where we're gonna be driving uh, down near Moab. So they got probably one of the most beautiful drives we're gonna to drive today in the whole US. It's just an absolute beautiful drive. So you guys will be along with us for the ride along. So let's head to Lowe's.
have arrived at the shipper Lowe's. So we gotta move these tandems all the way back. And then go get our load. So we will be back. blows that was good there we go Good so far. so far. Yeah. You're like at the perfect width between everything. I'm glad I'm glad you're just doing small little turns. <laughs> Had to get out of that sun. Too bright. It's blinding. Good job, Adrian. So he's following his lines, looking at the trailers. You're in. Huh? You're in. Sure. You're in. On your own. I didn't say nothing. So that was all you. That wasn't nothing to do with me. All right, guys. Adrian did a really great job backing in. He understands the concept. That was perfect. little too heavy on the trailer so we're gonna have to move those tandems back let's go back uh, we'll go back five holes See what they're at this time. Much better. So 11.3 on the steers, 25.1 on our drives, 33.20 on our trailer. Overall, we're at 69.7. So I'm fine with that. Just wanted to fill up anyway, so. All right, guys, we are headed out onto the road. See you out there. So we are up on Loveland Pass right now. 
and we are just about to go through the Eisenhower tunnel it's a nice long tunnel that goes underneath these ski passes right here pretty neat some homeless people up here they probably got stuck man I got hurt on the slopes dude I don't have any way down to like Denver man
We have arrived at the consignee Lowe's, so we are going to drop this trailer right here and then take this trailer, hook it up, pull it out, probably put it right up here somewhere, and then hook up to this trailer, and then put it back in the hole right here. And then hook back up to this trailer, clean it out, and then get out of here. <laughs> it's a it's a little bit of a process here. Good, you missed the barrier on this side, and um, the good thing is there's not much to clean up back, so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's really not. That wants to hit you. You really shake it. But as far as like the small hook is concerned, it's not. Yeah. I told you, it, like in your brain, it'll just start clicking. So here we go. Pretty much got to get it right in between those two yellow lines right there. in there. Good job. See, I told you it'd start clicking in your brain. Guys, we're at the end of the video. Please like, subscribe, share. Thank you to all our new subscribers. Keep watching our videos. Peace out. See you on the other side.